hello guys welcome back to beauty with ty and today i have a very very simple makeup look so i have sisters and my oldest sister she does makeup every day she has like a full beat and then i have another sister who doesn't wear any makeup she's just getting into the routine of like filling in her eyebrows and putting on mascara this video is dedicated to my sissy here's my simple no makeup look I have a total of five makeup products that I will be using today and one of them is High End uh, which is my eyeshadow from MAC. Also using two makeup brushes, an angle brush and a fluffy eyeshadow brush as well as a lippy. So that's really a total of eight products. However, only five is going on my face face. I start off by doing my eyebrows and taking my angle brush. This one is by MAC and it's the number 266. You do not have to get this particular angle brush. Any angle brush would do. This is the only angle brush that I have and my dark brown eyeshadow. I'm just basically gonna follow the line of my eyebrow. So I do like to start off with my arch going into my tail. So just brush it like that. I don't do too much in the front. Just take that leftover product and just put that on. Don't worry about it. if it gets down here, we're going to clean it up. So that's basically how it looks now. If you get it too dark for your likings, you just want to take a spoolie and just brush it. It's going to fade. Um, this step is optional, but I do like to do it. I take a concealer that is my skin tone, and this is in the color Beautiful Bronze. See, right here. And you get this from the hair store or offline. $4 now because everybody on it. I use the applicator that's on it and rub it a little bit on the back of my hand. And then I'm going underneath my brow to clean it up. So any makeup that kind of got below when you was filling in your brows, you, you can clean it up. So. And then just bring that down. And just take your finger and blend it out. Take your blending brush and just like sweep it. See, just like that. Then I take the rest off of my hand or on my brush and just dab it on my eyelid. So you see that a little bit? See how that made a difference? I'm just dabbing it on my eye. If you need, get you a little extra product. So we're basically going to prep, which I like to use the Black Radiance Contour Kit because you can use it for so many things, to contour, to highlight, to just put in your crease. So with my skin tone, I like to take this middle color and you will basically set everything when you use the eyeshadow. So I'm taking my blending brush and this middle color of the contour kit, and this kit is $5 at Walmart and hair stores. And this is the powder kind because they have come up with a new count. So I'm just going to take my brush and just set everything. And give me a little color on my eyelid. So for like the people that have like veins that show through or you know stuff like that. By you concealing your, eye, your eyelids and then putting a little color on it. It just sets everything. And I like to take it up a little bit. Set that and my eyelid. Using that same brush. And then this highlight color. Use the same brush. 
Yeah, and just give it a light dust. See that nice little glow underneath the brow? Eyeliner is optional as well. Since we're going very simple, I am just going to do basically mid, way, and back. I like to use a liquid eyeliner. And this one is by Wet n Wild. I got it from Walmart for like $2 and some change. I start like in the middle and work my way back as close to the line. See how I did just a little simple look there? Or you can just put on mascara. So let me show before I line this eye. I can show you guys. Now you can see this eye does not have eyeliner. And this side does have eyeliner. It's up to you. The call is yours. Okay, and as far as the lips, you can keep it simple or do whatever. Um, the first option is just some regular lip gloss. This is from Victoria's Secret. Like this. Y'all like my case? Isn't it so cute? It's Jack Daniels. My sister got it for me. 